The main programs at Southeast Community College that encompass manufacturing are manufacturing engineering technology, precision machine and automation, and electrical mechanical technology. My name is Drew Health. I'm from Omaha, Nebraska. I graduated from the electromechanical program in June and I'm completing the electrical program now. I was browsing through my options and I, when I found Milford I saw what they had to offer and the electromechanical program was the spot for me. It's building the circuit, um, understanding how it works and then usually the teachers will break it to make you fix it. It's a fun way to learn and it's very it's challenging. I really didn't expect the automation part of the program to be so important. Um, once you get your hands on it, you learn how big of an impact it has on manufacturing and how important it's going to be for me and my career in the future if I choose to go down that path. While I don't exactly know what I'm going to be doing in the future, there's so many opportunities that I can take advantage of, and SEC has really prepared me well to go and find those opportunities. Recently we went through a, a major renovation and expansion in the electrical electromechanical program. When a student comes into this program, what they're, going, what they're going to see and what they're going to be involved with will be everything from the very simplest electrical uh, and electronic uh, theories to the most advanced uh, technology uh, components of a manufacturing facility. A typical day for an electrical electromechanical student would be about a 50-50 split between uh, theory and lecture and actual hands-on laboratory experience. Students in our program enjoy getting their hands on robots, high-speed automated process controls, and the systems that support those. The job opportunities for electrical and electromechanical graduates are numerous. Out of 47 graduates last year, we had over 500 job openings. The employers are saying great things about our graduates, but they want and need more of them. I'm Scott Volk. I graduated from SCC in 1995. I'm the Vice President of Metal Quest Unlimited in Hebron, Nebraska. I've been in manufacturing for 18 years. SCC did a great job of giving me the fundamentals to get out and do my job in manufacturing. I was at SCC for three years, um, 18 months apiece for each degree I have. I have a degree in machine tool technology and manufacturing engineering technology. SCC prepared me for a job here at Metal Quest. My name is Ty Austin, I'm from Battle Creek, Nebraska. I'm in the Precision Machining and Automation program and we are currently doing a lot of making our own pneumatic machines and molds and dyes as well. I chose SCC because the job that I worked out for up in Battle Creek, most of the employees there work there and this is one of the best colleges in the nation for precision machining and automation. With the new addition SCC has, we have a lot of new cutting edge machines and these are more machines you'll see out in industry once you get out of college. SEC is really preparing me for my career because of the way that it gives you the basic design that you have to make, but you also have to go through and make it yourself and kind of design it and tweak the design a little bit so that it works. And I think that during college I've learned a lot and it's going to help me and I'm excited to get back to work and show off what I know now. The Precision Machining and Automation program, um, we recently underwent a name change. For many years we were known as the world of machine tool, tool and die. But like all other things in industry, we're evolving, we're changing, we're becoming more automated, we're becoming a more higher tech with the equipment that's just being introduced into our line of work. We still teach the fundamentals of all of the traditional machining levels and styles, but we're now much more heavily getting into the world of CNC and we are diving into the world of automation, which is becoming a more and more critical part of maintaining efficiency in the world of manufacturing. Um, we're not just always out in the shop just running machines. We have we have theory classes, we have design classes, and then we do have our traditional lab times that most people are familiar with. So we do a lot of things, not just out building parts. We spend a considerable amount of time um, educating the students on maybe the theory elements of being a tool maker versus just the practical application out in the shop. You know, we have a very storied program. It's really gone up great. This new addition and new funding has really allowed us to get new machines with advanced technology, current technology more appropriately, so that when our students graduate, they're really going to be in touch with what is out there in industry. The opportunities and directions that students can head once they get a degree in precision machining and automation from SEC is absolutely phenomenal. The future looks incredibly bright. I mean, we literally have employers lined up at the door waiting 
sometimes fighting over our students to get them because the need for good quality tool makers and CNC people, um, people who can design and, and, and live and survive in the world of automation is very, very high. We can say with a very high degree of confidence that a degree in precision machining and automation from SCC is going to equip you very well to have a successful career out in the workforce in the world of manufacturing. As an employer, it's very important to come to SCC. We know we're going to get a good quality student. They have all the fundamentals that we need. They have a, you know, a great foundation for us to build off of and do the training we need to do to allow them to succeed at our company. In high school, I got the basic fundamentals of how to machine and how to draw parts. Milford, it gave me more of advance and how to, why we do it this way, more look in depth to everything, which really helps out when I come here to work every day. I'm Mark Eilers. I'm the program chair of Manufacturing Engineering Technology at Southeast Community College in Milford, Nebraska. A uh, manufacturing engineering technologist is a person when they go out and work on the job, they are the person that's either going to design uh, products for a company or design machines to help make products for a company. In manufacturing engineering, our students focus on design of products or design of machines. Um, in that, they have a good solid foundation for whatever they do, so as they graduate and leave and move out into the workplace, they are prepared for the job. A great student for manufacturing engineering technology is a student that is, if I hand them a part or a product, they want to take it apart and they want to understand how does it work. When students come into manufacturing engineering, they're very excited. They see all the opportunities that are laid out before them and the potential um, at the end of the program. I'm Austin Roach. I'm in the manufacturing engineering technology program at Southeast Community College. SCC hits every possible aspect you could hit for manufacturing. Uh, you can design the plant, you could design the machines that's going to make your products. Uh, the products itself, dyes, molds, everything, every finished product you could think of. Uh, I've heard from friends and people that have graduated from the programs that they have better job opportunities and they get you in and out of school faster than any other school out there. My favorite part about SCC has probably been going to the machine shop and actually making something and using my hands. I'm in my fifth quarter now and there's people coming in all the time wanting new employees, new students graduating, and I've already had five job opportunities and not even graduated yet. So I'm proud to say that I'm three months from graduation and I've already got five opportunities to go see new employers. and decide where I want to go. Students have the option to not only go right into their career, they have the opportunity to transfer their program or their credits to a four-year school and further their education.